Here we go. Here we go. Jeez. Some big tires right here. Custom Offsets just sent us some new shoes for the uh, truck, but with that, we feel like we need to do the thing. Yeah, yeah, get all of the use out of our current tires as possible. So I think I'm gonna do it. Am I doing it? I thought Ryan was gonna do it in, re Ryan, in, do it, in redemption. Dude, I'm kind of scared. I can't take another video where everybody calls me a dummy. Ryan, you're gonna have to redeem yourself eventually. You're gonna be stuck in the dummy zone until that moment. <laughs> Uh, do I have to? Good luck. He didn't look thrilled, but this is gonna go great because it's not an all-wheel drive car. Right. You're an artist, okay? Paint this. Oh, now, now, now it makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody, get your phones out and start holding them like this. That's when something's gonna go down. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me check, let me check. Too much tread. Oh my gosh, dude, this thing needs more power. Oh, no, the truck doesn't have enough power. His Jeep doesn't have enough power. Can you get him enough power in the next Hold two on, minutes? Hold on, let me help him, I'll help him. All right, Ryan, go. <laughs> Yeah, that, that looks like proper wear. So I know we told you guys that we were gonna be bringing you along with our shop remodel, and you guys seem to really want to see it. So anyways, right now, we got Dan and Steve, and they're cutting a hole in our wall, and that sliding glass door right there is gonna be going in. Because we're actually putting a patio right here. So they're gonna pour concrete, and we'll put the hot tubs, patio furniture, probably a fire pit, and all that. So it's gonna add a lot to the building, because besides for these windows right here, there's no windows in our shop, and it is kind of like a dungeon in there. Anyways, we'll keep you posted. Good morning, Mike. I don't know how he's still sleeping when we got these dogs going on. So we got the door going in over here, but we have also been spending quite a bit of time cleaning out the other two stalls, which the previous owner, Randy, had a lot of his stuff in still because he is building a new shop. Put the before picture and now look at yeah, it. Yeah, dude, it's so open. I mean, there's still quite a bit of stuff in here that has to go, but like, yeah. <laughs> That's amazing, boys. So we're gonna have a lot of room to play. Like we said before, we're gonna actually take this wall down. This room is gonna be extremely cool. Echo! So our plan, because this room is going to be giant, is going to be put two shipping containers in it and make like a work bay in the middle. We're going to paint them. Uh, we want like an artist to come and like paint a mirror on the side of one right. of them, like make them really cool. But like this room, you're going to walk in and be like, whoa. And then we got one more bay to show them where we basically have all of our toys in right now. And that's this guy right here. I'll open it up. So the best toy in here, obviously, is the lawnmower. This thing, seriously, one of the best purchases we've made. Possibly even better than the shop. What's up, guys? I'm happy and honestly relieved to announce that we have a sponsor for today's video. Private Internet Access. Private Internet Access is the leading no-log-on VPN with over 30 million downloads. So if you guys are anything like my buddy Ben over here, I have literally no idea what a VPN is. So basically, a VPN is a private network that allows you to keep your information safe from hackers and gives you access to restricted sites. For example, last year we were up in Canada and we were trying to watch some Hulu, but it was blocked. But thankfully, we had this VPN, so we used it, changed our location back to the US, and we could watch Hulu. We've even had to use it to unblock things like Amazon Prime and Netflix while we're on the road. Private internet access works on literally all platforms, from your computer to your phone to even your Amazon Fire Stick. Private internet access has over 10 years of experience protecting your data. They even have a kill switch. So if your VPN ever goes down, it'll cut your internet connection and your information will be safe. It's easy to use. Just download it and forget about it. No logging on each time you start your computer. They have 3,000 servers in over 49 countries, making sure wherever you are, you're covered. Go through the link in the description and support our channel. Get 77% off and three months free. Yo, what up? 
What up with you? Uh, not much, just driving. You coming to work today? It's 2.30. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess I can swing by. Swing by? You gonna just swing by? We were supposed to have a video up today. Yeah, I know, but just Mike and, and Ken have all just been hanging out. Whoa, whoa. We're close by, we'll be over in a bit. Close by, we'll be over in a bit. What, what is going on? Yo, CJ, Micah, and Ken hanging out. <laughs> no way. Oh. What up? Why? Why did you guys buy these? You guys bought three smart cars? I, I told the I told the viewers last week, I said, what do you guys think about a smart car gang? They all loved it. CJ kind of just woke me up and said, run to the bank, grab some cash. So I don't know if you guys didn't get the invite or what, but. Yeah, we've been basically just mobbing around for the past couple of days. Yeah, we wouldn't invite you guys, you didn't have, you don't have cars, you know? Like, what are you gonna drive? It's a very exclusive group. Yeah, basically. And these things, 0.8 liters. 0.8 liters? <laughs> Not even a one liter Dude, engine. my car has eight times that. Woo. You don't need to. You don't need to. Black right, just out here. <laughs> Dude, yeah, that. Take for a ride if you want. What? You guys are so dumb. <laughs> this is Dude, red interior. Though. Beautiful heated seats. Honestly, I think Mike got the best one. Why? Why? Because they're dope, dude. What do you mean? <laughs> I mean, it's funny. I'll give you that. They're definitely funny. Okay, give her some pepper. You know that this thing is like twice as loud as your uh, Focus RS, right? I know. That's a performance vehicle, Ken. This is a smart car. I know, you gotta overcompensate for it. That I don't know if that's uh, a diss on your car or what, though. It's, you just got, you, this thing is slow as, Ken, it's so. And it's rear wheel drive, correct? It is. Yeah, I'm learning so much about smart cars. Oh, we got a little, Ken, hop in, hop in. <laughs> Ken, catch up. Catch up, Ken! I don't know who to film right now. I don't now. know what's going also, on. I don't know when to make a break for it. Look at, look at Ken in his car. Why does he remind me of Mr. Bean for some reason? Look at him. Look at him right now. Hey, Ken. I might have to chop my muffler off. But it sounds good. At first, it was pretty rice, but now there's nothing rice about this at all. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Ken, you, you kind of got the shit wagon, though, didn't you? I did kind of get the shit wagon. I need, I need new brakes, which... Hopefully Wade shows up with those. Oh, you already them. ordered them? I did. They're even showing up today. What? Wow. Wait, what did you pay? 2000 What did you pay? 2500 And he paid? 26 26 Ken, are you going to daily this? Yeah. Oh, uh, if You're going to have less problems with this than your RS. If, if I can fix this thing up so it drives good, yeah, I probably will. Dude, she almost backed over me. Well, listen, it's not going to do a whole lot of damage. You know, maybe a sore leg, but... Look at the back of CJ's car. Let me turn around. <laughs> Dude, driving him, you're jerking him off. Look good, bro. That's yeah. really good. I'm surprised that you do that in here Chip without right like here. tinted windows and stuff. Do what? Jerk off. What? <laughs> I'm just surprised you do it without tinted windows, that's all. Like, I've done <laughs> yeah. it before, but I, I know I got tinted windows. Yeah. You I'm little so hornball, right you little hornball, you. <laughs> That's not, like, that is not a, I don't know where you're getting this joke from. Like, I don't jerk off you're just a little car. horn ball. <laughs> what? You, you just can't. Are you jerking off? I'm like, what? <laughs> Buddy, just can't hold it in. What? It's fun to chase Ken. Oh shit, go Ken, go! Ken! Oh, hop on, Ken! Go on, hop on it! Oh, fuck, it's slippery! Dude, these oh, no, smart no, no, no. cars, just the epitome of our tomfoolery. I, I would agree with that. <laughs> what are you doing, it, Mike? <laughs> Hit the double! 
You need more speed, you're good. Am I gonna bottom out? No, you'll be fine. Oh, oh shit, oh shit. Oh, you shit. lost the side skirt. You lost the side skirt, bud. Is it not a jumping machine? What the Hey, feel I'm in the mood for a switch up. I hit the function, hit the rose right till I hiccup. I hit the stage and leave with money that's a stick up. She picture perfect, so I told him I'm a flicker. Feel I'm in the mood for a change up. I leave the city and return with my change up. They got amnesia, don't remember how they played us. They wanna knock me down, but somehow I just stay up. Straight to the stage, they love me. love me I understand they hungry But please don't hate, that's ugly I have been sliding, shaking, moving I been popping in my city well, okay. Shawty say she love the way we do it Do it with me I be too turned up to ever give a I ain't come to argue, let a Please, baby They been talking pennies, I need bigger bucks About to catch a flight, I need to switch it up Got that black boy joy, might do my dance on me no disrespect, might put my hands on him. City pop. Hit his chicken, now she wanna marry me. Okay, but she I can't believe so Cat can sit in this. No Came back to the city <laughs> with my bank account <laughs> on F. <laughs> Giving rappers, I know they happy that I left. Alright, guys, so as we announced in the last video, or two videos ago, uh, we gave away our RS1, and the winner's name was Nathan from Wisconsin. Nathan from Wisconsin, what's up, bro? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, mom. Jolene, yep. Nice to meet you. <laughs> there, we got the whole squad today. Nice. How was the drive? Right. Yeah, we what time? 2.30 in the morning. 2.30 in the morning? Yeah. All right, Nathan drove eight and a half hours just to get here, so we're not going to make him wait too much longer. But here's the RS1. I'll stand out there with him, get his reaction. You rip it out. All right, you ready? Yeah. What do you think? What do you say? Enjoy it like this because as soon as it hits anywhere, it's gonna be covered in dust. Yeah, have you wow. ever driven anything like this? Not this big, no. <laughs> but you said you had a go-kart. Yeah. This is pretty much just a glorified go-kart. Okay, hop in, buddy. Oh man. With the bigger tires, it does get a little tippy. Yeah. So you can go fast. And you can hit the brakes and you can turn, but just don't do it all at once. And if not, it's yours now. Yeah. All right, you ready, bro? Damn, just getting right into the track. Oh! He is wasting no time. Not at all, dude. What do you think? That's insane. That's way faster than I thought. Holy crap. Bro, I can't believe you just got right into <laughs> it. You, you started booting it. You, you didn't even do a test lap. All right, bro. Well, uh, let me go get a quad. Well, I'll go get some quads and we'll go rip with you. Right. Hey, Micah, since I got you here, guess what we just hit? A million subscribers. Yeah, we just hit a million subscribers. No, we haven't. So subscribe because we're trying to hit a million subscribers. Look at that. Oh, on the dot. Uh, I didn't have this lined up. Uh, because I knew it was gonna happen. Here it is. <laughs> <laughs> this is Justin's quad, the tried and true, trusty Justin's quad. He's had this thing since he was like freaking 13. Everyone said it was clap, but it's not that clap. And I bought it. So. And you got a really good deal on it. Yeah. The only thing that we're a little skeptical on <laughs> is. Justin changed the oil on this thing one time since our friendship has began. Either way, dude. Welcome to the squad. Yo, quad they squad. got their smart car squad, and we got, oh wait, you're part of the. I'm part of it all, man. It's so nice to have this track now. We can just have the giveaway winner take whatever vehicle it is out on the track. It's so nice. Man, it looks good. It's good. No. No, you trust him? Oh, yeah. I do too, honestly. Holy crap. That was a little far. That was 
like to flat. Yeah, <laughs> this thing rips a little bit. you want to have any last final words? I don't know, man. How about your couple near-death experiences in it? I'm going to say I almost died in this thing. going to kind of mess it. <laughs> uh, goodbye, Aris one. I love you. You had a lot of great memories. Congratulations. I'm happy for you. This is going to be a blast for you, man. Thank All right, you. it's officially yours. <laughs> Thank you. What's up guys, better late than never. We finally got our shorts. Trunks by Sea Boys TV, they turn out fire. I know it's like August, but we've been working really hard on them all summer and they finally got here, so. Why the f is my Fuck <laughs> it. <laughs> also, we branded them Trunks Co. because we wanted to make swim trunks that aren't just Sea Boys TV. So if you don't know what Sea Boys TV is, you might just like the trunks. So that's why we, we branded them as Trunks Co. So go grab a pair if you can or want to, or at least check them out. Alright, CJ is convinced that he can get his smart car to drift around this pole, and there is no way. Yeah! That was pretty good! We're trying to figure out how to turn traction control off. I'm sure you guys are a part of a very limited crew that wants to turn traction control yeah, off. It was like the amount of people car. that have probably even figured that out if it's a thing. Turn the ignition off, take your hands, and yes, you need big hands for this. <laughs> oh! Scared me, dude. Let's go. Okay, I'll teach you how to do it. What? Holy what? crap, dude. Yo, you gotta help me. One, two, two, one, let go. Okay. Give it a shot. Dude, these smart cars just became so much more capable. I'm so excited. <laughs> shift into second gear so you can't hold it in first gear because then it'll be like oh I'm gonna shift even if you're in paddles or in manual mode <laughs> dude my transmission is not happy with me like I don't it's like going now but it keeps like just going to neutral dude my muffler came I think unconnected when we were doing the dust Take back what I said about these things being pieces of shit. They're incredibly enjoyable to drive. Bro, so much fun. The only issue is I want to bumper cart you guys driving down the road. So what do you guys think? Was the smart cars a good buy? Comment down below. Do you want to see us like, like modify these things? I don't know I what can we can you. do yet. I'm gonna have to start looking into some aftermarket parts for this thing, yeah. but uh, hit the subscribe button. Be on the lookout for more smart car content. <laughs> Never in my life did I hear, would think I would hear CJ say, keep an eye out for more smart car content. All right, so Tint gave me a call, told me he's coming over with a smart car, and dude, check it out. He loaded it up really weird. Put it in the back of his truck. What, what the oh, heck? Mark? And another one? What? Yes. We got another one. Dude. Oh my gosh, the gang's finally forming together. And then there was five. Yes, dude. How did you get this in the back of your truck? Forklift. Freaking for it. Easy quad unload? Yeah. Well, easy smart quad unload. I'll just stop recording. Sorry. I like to jam out this thing. <laughs> Bro, it's like it was nothing. <laughs> Why was that so smooth? Not a clunker. He's like, I don't know if it's supposed to do this. <laughs> Dude, it sounds like you installed subwoofers. Bro, that's the AC unit. 
sorry, Ken. <laughs> <laughs>